All right, we are almost back to where we were before. Hopefully this time the floor doesn't give out on me. It was right there where I went up and then it cracked. And I can keep going this way. Huh. Trying to ignore this caterpillar. Does this just take me further? Uh, okay, okay, I see. Hopefully this eventually leads me over to where Let's I'm trying see. to get to. Maybe agriculture is Poppy's Leave it to specialist me. field. I know maybe, more than Poppy, I maybe. Only time will tell. But thank you for all those items. I want that as well. If I had fallen there, I would have been highly upset, I assure you. I thought that this bang might attack us. I wasn't going to say anything. I'm going to be honest. I, I can't be bothered by a single little bang. What on earth? Hello. Goodbye. I'm just passing by. Don't mind me. I'll be out of your way in no time. Where on earth am I now? Everything looks the same in this area. I have no idea where I'm going or where I'm supposed to end up. I wish this stupid bang would screw off so I could see the compass and it would tell me where to go. More. A hero's work is oh my goodness, done. are you kidding me? Copy Actually copy screw copy off. On. Is this combat never gonna end? Is it actually infinite? Thank you. Why are there so many of these Looks dusky like Rick? Goodbye. Like oh, Tora is down. That's actually really bad. How did he end up dying? Where on earth am I going? You know what? Stop for a second. I'm probably going to fight some kind of crazy spider enemy in here soon. Wait a minute. Did I end up going the right way? I think I did. Huh. How about that? Lucky me. You mean to tell me a spider did not drop down on me right there? Everything I know about video games is a lie. We're getting close, though. I ended up going the right way somehow. I'm not entirely sure how, but I did. Right over here is our next cutscene, it appears. Rex? We've come a long way. I think it's time for a break. What? Hold your horses. There's a long way to go yet. Oh. Hey, you too, Nia. Come rest your head on my lap if you like. Why don't you rest your head in your ass? I'm sorry, everyone. I had no idea. There's no need to apologize. I understand. Poppy, now is good time to cool drive, Furnace. Aye, aye, Master Pawn. Sorry. Isn't being here longer only going to make it worse for the blades? Shouldn't we, like, just keep going until we can get the heck out? Emergency air. It might help. Oh, thanks. Oh, not like that. You have to hold your nose and then inhale really deeply. Now stretch out. And puff out your chest. Is this another of your salvager tricks? Go on, just try it. <sighs> Whoa, that really did the trick. Right? When I was starting out, this was one of the first things the other salvagers taught me. Even though they acted like my parents, they never really taught me anything worthwhile. I did manage to pick up a couple of useful tricks, though. Parents. Well, uh, my dad was real enough, but I can't say he really taught me anything either. He was a well-known lord in Gorbot, a real big cheese. He made me study hard. But it was all how to be a proper lady, which fork to use. Nothing that's doing me any good now. Just useless shite. You were some kind of high society princess. I can't picture it. Shattered you. 
I did studying. But, looking back, those were the happiest times of my life. There was my dad, and my big sis, the three of us. You had a sister? Yeah. She was very frail. I spent a lot of time at her bedside. My dad brought doctors from all over to try and help her. He tried so hard. It was all he thought about. After that point, my memories aren't so happy. Mia. Dad spent all his money on chasing a cure and lost his position as a lord. From then on, we became drifters. <sighs> it was a tough life. It took its toll on my sister. She died not long after. Anyway, I'm sorry for talking your year off. Thanks for the salvage trick. It really worked. Sneaky git. If you had this all along, why did you hold out on me? I feel much better. Shall we go, Rex? That entire story was really undermined by the fact that every time she said da, <laughs> like, I just rolled my eyes. It was like, this is the stupidest phrase for a father figure I've ever heard. Is that a miasma block that we have to have rock for right there? It's been ages since we've oh. seen one of those. Apparently, this is the crucible of share all of your old uh, character building stories. First Zeke, then Nia. Like Is Mirai going to have some kind of a secret past to tell us about Scatter soon? Shot. About how she grew up with her brother? Who isn't even really her brother? Isn't it? Didn't we hear that it's not actually her brother? They're like cousins or something? And Mirai was next in line for the throne, but it needed to be a male that took the throne, so her cousin got it, the nephew of the king, the previous king? I think that's what it was. I can't remember. Yeah, do it, Tora. Get him with the heat. Mainly because I want to have Nia do what she just did anyways. The healing move. Die, you stupid liar. However you say this thing's name. I'm not charging up my blade arts with Pandoria, either. Is it just this area? Does this area stop me from charging up my arts? Is that what's happening? And, and now I'm dead. You know what, Nia? We don't have time for that right now. I just want this thing to be dead. So we can't get like any higher than level one arts? This sucks, I hate this place. I need to kill you before you kill me. Nope, too late. Ah, oh, I hate this area. Nia, I don't have time for you being you. It's officially like my least favorite area of the game. Oof. Oof, indeed. Further on we go. Oof. Yeah, let's go in here. What could possibly go wrong? I cannot see anything. What is this? This is actually horrible. <laughs> Zeke, what are these noises you're making, dude? I'm actually using the mini-map to navigate. Like, I cannot see a thing. This is a nightmare. Here's the miasma. Malign miasma. It is good to dwell on what? the past from time to time. I don't have a single character with dark mastery. Never seen it before in my life. Maybe one of my random blades has it. I don't know. Can I get out in your either? It is no, I have to, to have dark mastery level five. Where am I supposed to go then? I didn't see any other pathway to take. 
I actually hate this, too. This is awful. So I can't go... I gotta find another path somewhere. Surely the game doesn't progress lock you out with needing five Dark Mastery. That is, if it does, then this playthrough is actually over. Because that's the stupidest thing I've seen in this game. If that is the case. Vestige of Light. Fire, guide me. Oh, I forgot I have, like, no Fire Mastery if I don't have Pyro with me. Because she has, like, level Let's two or three see. or something. Leave it to me. I know more than I let on. Indeed you do. As you're always keen on telling me. Alright, well, we're back out here now. Which way am I supposed to possibly go, then? This actually just looks... This entire area just looks horrible. I don't want to be here. <laughs> Can I make the jump here and live? All right, well, that's a good start. I'm definitely not... I hate Urkins. I'm definitely not finding a signature one. I think I'll live this, too. Oof. I was wrong. It was a calculated gamble. I'm pretty sure that right there is where I'm supposed to end up. We'll have to be extra careful from now on. Yeah, clearly. Proceed with caution next time. Do you think that airflow might have made me jump downwards instead of upwards? That could maybe Oof. have been a possibility. Because I thought it would send me back up, so I didn't jump to it. Oof. But maybe that's not the case. Huh. Oof. There's really only one way to find out, isn't there? Come, Win please. mastery level five, get out of here. What is with this area and its ridiculous requirements? I don't want to fight. I don't even want to go near that Urkin. It's just going to immediately kill me. I can't survive the fall from here, though. I got to, like, get over there, jump down there, and then jump from there down to there. I have to, like, it'll, like, break my fall, sort of. This Urkin has a blade. Hard-bitten Xavier. Yeah, screw you. I ain't about it. More? More? Is never done. It's never done, I say. Oof. That was a lot of damage, but we got out of the fight, so it's all good. This is probably not the way you're supposed to do this. But do I care? Haha, <laughs> no. Not even slightly. Look at that, like, what bone Lexos here? down there. Nice. Very nice. An Aspid. I just want to get a good look at it. It looks cool. It's not even as bony as I thought. I thought I had, like, a bone helmet on. This is definitely where the next cutscene is, though. Thank goodness. Looks like the only way through is by force. Poppy! Incendiary barrage! Roger, roger. Whoa, stop, stop, stop! You want to bring the whole cave down on top of us? It was joke. Poppy has no such weaponry. That wasn't funny. Oh. Oh, that makes a lot of sense, actually. Centaur through first, to be safe. Does this also have something to do with your connection to the Aegis? No idea. But look. No footprints. We're the first people here. Then there could still be hope. What do you mean, no footprints? Look at this, look. Look at this flooring. You expect footprints to be left behind? What, does someone who weighs like 700 pounds walk through and his feet make enough force to leave footprints on this solid stone? What are you talking about, no footprints? Are you actually high, Rex? What does that have to do with anything? We got like a thousand feet almost to go, that's ridiculous. We're almost out of time for today, but we will get closer before I wrap up. But we're definitely not gonna... Even if I get to whatever this next cutscene is, 
I'm not gonna what go through with it. Here? Middle Worm Ridden nice. Cave. This sounds like a nightmare. Very nice. Uh, we're definitely not going to proc whatever the next cutscene is today. Most definitely. I, I'm gonna be honest with you. I want to fight, like, literally zero of anything in this area. Like, I don't, I don't even care about that treasure that trove enough to deal with it. I'd really much rather just be done with this area. On this way we go. Thankfully, Caterpiles, like, never aggro for some reason. I definitely don't want to fight these things, but I gotta, like, run past them. Don't notice me. They that notice me. Leave me alone. What on earth is that? No thank you. What the Looks heck? Do like I need to climb here? I do. I was confused for a second there. I was afraid that those enemies were still going to be chasing me while I was climbing. That would have been bad. Yeah, it's cut off. If you think I'm fighting these guys, ha, you're wrong. I meant it. I'm, like, fighting nothing. Can't be asked. I would like to open this if this enemy would screw off. Before I, uh, jump, because I don't really know where else to go other than making a jump and running in a direction. You seriously still... I hate the enemies in this area. Oof. Penitent Spring. Okay. Is this thing still, like, being a douche? Are you kidding me right now? Actually, screw off. Oh my goodness, we're gonna die. I hate everything about this. Literally everything about this. This area sucks. We won't lose again. Zeke. Maybe if we do some prep. Maybe if we do some what? What did you even say? So going up there was a waste of time in the first place. I just want to go this way and ignore the blondes, hopefully. This area is so annoying. All of this poison footing and these enemies and not being able to charge my blade arts. And being so confusing in where to walk to. I hate it. I hate all of it. I hate everything about this area. Literally nothing about it is good. The Chamber of Offering. This sounds like I might be near the cutscene and I don't want to proc the cutscene today. No, I've still got to be a ways away, surely. If all of these enemies would just thank you, screw off. I was about to say. What's here? We can try and get to that uh, thing right there really quickly before we go today. Oof. Have I mentioned that I hate this area yet? Because I do. I wanted to get to that treasure trove. Let's get past these spiders that I'm also not going to fight. Surprise, surprise. Please tell me that I can open this. Fire All right, you know what? Me. You know what? Not today, game. Not today. Not today. I have no... All of these random blades. I actually hear they are. I do have some. I was about to say, I have no fire blades. I didn't see them at first. Make sure that... Uh, Fire Mastery, yep. And then Fire Mastery. Ready Perfect. Roll. Open the way. Here we go. Thank you. Do do. Set these guys back before I forget. It sounds fun. Hankering for our banquets? What? <laughs> she say hankering for banquets? We're gonna see what's in this next room and then we're done for today. Wow, Chamber of Pillars. Amazing places in it. Steel of Judgment? Oh, this sounds fun. This is a good as place as any to wrap up for today, I would say. It's not what I wanted. I could have gone to the save menu from there, but pressing minus is faster. All right, we're done for today. We've made some progress story-wise, getting further into the Crucible. I can't wait to be out of the Crucible because the Crucible sucks. This place is awful, I hate it. But uh, hopefully we will get the third sword and be done with this area and never return to it next time. So yeah, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you then. And until that time, farewell.